removed from the harbor in or well very close to the center of Lisbon because it was very noisy there and wasn't very well protected against the waves and such and just was also expensive it kind of sucked so um, we took a very big harbor um, that's a bit outside Lisbon but not so much that we can ride our bikes there it's about I think eight kilometers or something like that a bit more maybe I think we're very very satisfied of our choice the water was muy bueno and we can uh, just drink it so that's fine so we can also get drinking water yeah everything's great here and they have like bars over there and everything cool. <laughs> they have like bars everything's really cozy um, yeah. so is it better than the one in Lisbon it's just a tiny bit I think maybe. tiny yeah tiny like bit I this like, much I like trains uh, we met up with a Swedish and a Norwegian boat that we've met on the way and we all came here and spent the night together eating some food and just having a good time. It's pretty good red weather right now and I think I'm gonna go get a haircut and maybe get some demineralized water for our batteries because they need that. So hopefully I won't look this bad for long. If you notice the timestamps in the corner, there's a pretty big gap here. That's because I've had a big pile of footage that I had to edit. And I didn't really want to add on to that pile while I was editing since that's pretty demotivating. But I just finished. Uh, the last clip has been edited. I'm uploading episode 5 and I'm working on episode 6. So tomorrow I'm gonna start filming again. So. It's gonna be great! Today I really wanted to go into the city and get some of the things that we broke on the boat and try to replace it. But on the way, way into Lisbon, um, I apparently rode my bike over some thorns from some bush or something. And they punctured both my tires. But to make, make it sting a little bit less, I bought some cake. And some Coca-Cola. So maybe maybe tomorrow I'll actually get something nice filmed and get some things for the boat. It's been almost three weeks now in Portugal. We've been here for quite a long time. La Piggy is currently out trying to buy parts for his uh, bicycle because it's broken. Right now I'm sitting here eating breakfast. Uh, I ate some small butter cakes from uh, Mantigaria. Means uh, butter, buttery or something, I don't know. Butter makers. They're quite good, but better warm. Um, reading a little bit, Game of Thrones. Yeah, not yet. About to. I'm having a nice cup of coffee. Cheers. Good morning. Today is the 22nd of November. We are very messy in here. 
we are going for a cycle into the city for the many time we've had so many problems with our bikes we cycled over some spikes not long ago Lapiki's wheels were completely massacrated and you had to buy some new tire or hoses right mine has been uh, all right but i've had to fix them a couple of times Lapiki is going in to fix his bike because this uh this uh thing here is completely broken for some weird reason we have no idea why mine is fine the back gears i bought for my bike didn't fit because it has some weird weird fitting i i don't think i can find any new ones so i made a fix and today i'm going into lisbon to get all the stuff we need and hopefully getting a refund on the on the new back gears cassette whatever you want to call it and right now it's very pretty it's morning Anne is not with me because he's sleeping but I'm by this old fort or whatever the wind was kind of cold so I thought I should wear a jacket today I should definitely not wear a jacket today it's gotten a lot hotter and I have nowhere to put my jacket so that's great I've looked at two places that um, look pretty good and they work they both had the blocks or whatever they're called that uh, we broke and the first I looked at seemed to have the better ones so I think I'll buy them there but I haven't found anybody who are selling new bulbs for our navigational lights so I still need to find somebody who's selling that and also none of them sold any uh, Dacron Dacron tape or what you call it and none of them sold any um, string for uh, sewing sails because we also have a minor damage on our mainsail and of course as stupid as I am I forgot to charge my phone and sadly I'm pretty helpless without my phone so I have to go back and charge it I think seems like something's always getting in the way I think I think Lisbon hates me if you can't see it my tire just got flat and I looked at it and a big ass shot of glass was sticking out of my uh, back wheel back tire it was pretty easy to find the hole as the piece of glass was pretty big and as you can see as a result the hole is pretty goddamn big so that's exciting stuff it's all patched up and ready to go and today Anna is not sleeping and we'll try to go and get everything we need it doesn't seem that they really have it anywhere but we'll ask around and hopefully find it they got a nice memorial And there's fire and everything and guards on each side. I'm standing inside since so it's crazy hot right now. We just found by accident actually a store that has pretty much everything we need except the uh, the blocks or again whatever it's called in English. But one in that the centrum has the blocks we need so everything is good so I'm just um, I'm going back to the boat right now to get some measurements and look at some stuff to be sure to know what exactly we need and then I'll go back and buy that and buy the blocks and hopefully meet up with Anna again because he's got his priorities straight uh, so he's going to some Samsung laboratory thing to get a new uh, battery for his phone and not getting stuff to fix the boat so on my way to get what we need, but I took a minor detour to to record this. It's a very, very big monument, and it looks amazing right now. I got most of the stuff now from here. 
the rest of it we can get at the harbor, so I'm heading back now. I just made some oatmeal. Don't mind the mess, we're gonna fix that during today, I think. But after I've eaten this, I'll do something I haven't done for quite some time. I'll go running and I'll try to record it. So I hope it comes out great. the day that we've been here for one month because my dad called me yesterday and he said that he could see on the AIS that we've been here since the 2nd of November. Do you think we can leave today, Le Piggy? No. <laughs> Shit, I actually really? think we're gonna leave tomorrow, maybe early. I thought we're leaving today! Well, we have a lot of stuff we still need to do. Like finishing this shit up and this is what was busted. Yeah, one of the broken blocks. Those that came with the boat, they look kind of cheap. Yeah. So I think that's mainly why they broke. They look a bit Chinese, I guess. But even if it is not sturdy, at least we have learned maybe how not to uh, break them. Currently, I'm looking forward to doing the dishes. It's not too bad today, it's been way worse. And it's not very tidy in here, so I'm gonna try and tidy up a little bit. And then I'm gonna have a shower and see how ready we can get today. I have finished up putting on the last block. So it's all good new there. And I'm just going into the city to return the uh, back uh, gears for my bike that I couldn't use. Everything we broke is almost fixed now. We still need to uh, sew a tiny bit on the sail, but it's not that much. And right now I'm going to a fishing store to get some supplies for making a hand line that can catch us some mahi-mahi. I think Anna needs attention. But I'll try to uh, to actually uh, film while uh, biking right now on a on a bike mount I got. So let's see how that turns out.
Yesterday I got pretty much everything I need for my new fishing setup. I got some hooks that were a bit too small I think, but otherwise I have lots of good lures for getting some mahi mahi and maybe some tuna. Um, at least when we're going over the Atlantic, I'm not sure I can, can f catch something on the way to uh, to uh, the Canary Islands, but maybe. Shit. And then uh, me and Anna also went and uh, bought all the food we need for a trip to the Canary Islands. So we're completely stocked up now. We're going tomorrow and not today. Because... Yeah. <laughs> it's really easy <laughs> because we're not very good at estimating how long things take to do. Anna and I went to the marine store and I wanted, wanted to bring the camera but of course I forgot to charge it so it was empty and they're closed on ah! Sundays. <laughs> but at least we got these chestnuts which are actually pretty good. They're selling them pretty much everywhere on the street and they taste delicious although they're a bit hard to take with one hand at least with one hand at least with two hands it's very easy I think you don't you don't make it look terribly easy no but it was easy I think we are almost ready to sail we have stocked up on all sorts of things so our refrigerator is completely full and all our storage is full. The Piki is currently sewing the mainsail. Which I think is a very tedious job, maybe. I don't know. It's getting kind of ridiculous. Uh, we're not going today. We're waiting until tomorrow morning to go, but we're ready and we're prepared all the way now to go to Gran Canaria, so tomorrow we're going.